I left after the uh, seventh season of Seinfeld. They did two more years without me. Then I came back and I, I did the final episode. Then I did a movie. And after the movie, I was thinking, well, what am I going to do next? I was at Castle Rock. Jeff Garland was working on a pilot, and I would see Jeff from time to time, and, and he one day said to me, what are, what are you doing? And I said, I think I'm going to go back and do some stand-up. And he said to me, well, you should film it. I said, get, get out of here. That's a, that's a terrible idea. Larry! Let me ask you a question. Who do you think has more freedom? The, the married man in America or the single man in communist China? I gotta go for the single guy in Communist China. I'm proud to say Curb Your Enthusiasm is one of the funniest shows ever on television. You're looking at my girlfriend's First of all, breasts. They're not breasts. They they're, they're, they're not breasts. Know. They're just big chemical balls. Okay. The show took off because I think the cast really felt they were in, involved in something really good, whether they admit it or not. I meant beloved, beloved Anne, not beloved Larry, Larry, I think you should just leave. I just adore Larry. And you can't fake it. You sick fuck Larry David. You sicko fucko asshole. It was just this kind of, hey kids, let's do a show in the barn kind of show in the beginning. Oh my God. It's a hooker. The legacy's been there since his first season. The legacy is a fact now. I think I'm adopted. I might be adopted. I, th I, th I think I'm adopted. I, I could be adopted. This is a sad day for the Golden Globes. <laughs> it is, however, quite a good day for Larry David. I suspect the wife will be a little forthcoming tonight. 